tell us a little bit about how you handle things that might be controversial or dangerous or, or you know, those kind of, you, you provide those opportunities, but how do you manage the risk involved? Well, if there's something that's dangerous, like we, we often do in drama, we often do combat, hmm. you know, learning how to do stage combat. Mm-hmm. And there can be actual, you know, there can be contact and people get hurt. Right. Yeah. So it's a matter of the first thing is, is finding the appropriate space mm-hmm. because a, a lot of things aren't, are much less dangerous mm. if the space is appropriate. Right. So finding that, being sure that we know people are in the mix who have experience with whatever it is that we're dealing with, whether it's making fire or, you know, whatever it is. Mm -hmm. And then we just make sure that we have a, the, the, you know, accoutrements needed to keep it safe. So that might be, oh, in stage combat, you have to wear, you know, cushion on your head Mm -hmm. when you're practicing or with the fire building, where's the hose and the bucket and the, you know, it's that kind of planning Mm -hmm. that keeps it safe, but still, we always want to say yes. I mean, that's our goal is that, oh, if, if you think it's cool, it's probably cool and let's figure out a way to do it. Mm -hmm. There've been a few things over the years that like insurance, literally we can't do because Mm -hmm. insurance won't let us, unfortunately, Uh, but those are pretty few and far between. Mm we've been able to find ways to do most things. Mm -hmm. Can you give an example of something they forbade? (laughs) Yeah. Let me think of one that was forbidden. Oh, and we did it. We, yeah. So one thing that they forbade was the I fly experience, you know, that, that indoor Mm -hmm. thing. Um, So we, we gave the opportunity to our, to our families in a different way, not sponsored by us yeah. where they could interact with it individually. And, you know, iFly has all of their protections in place, right. you know, exactly. and so that's an example, mm-hmm. you know? Yeah. Yeah. But, um, but most, most other things we've figured out a way to, way to right. Do. Right. So there's, there's sort of, yeah, there's the restrictions of your insurance, but then there's a sort of you can also play a facilitative role that just doesn't sponsor, doesn't take responsibility for it. Right. Yeah. It just makes it available, you mm-hmm. know, like, oh, this is a fun thing. And, you know, right, right. but, but most things we can, we can do safely, mm-hmm. figure out a right, safe right. way to do it. And, and yeah. that, that also yeah. draws on your sort of the size of your community means that you have people with varieties of expertise, with different levels of experience that can come in and, 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 ensure that you're you're being reasonable about what you're doing right right like we have a whole uh there's a big long list of things in science um, Mm. in the science context that we have to do that that we maintain and manage from how things are stored in the room Mm -hmm. to you know there's there's certain things that we uh, have to do as a demo although we try to limit that as much as possible because we want the kids doing right, it right. but there's certain things that we have to do as a demo and and that's like based on you know federal guidelines not oh, yeah 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 so but uh but there there's a way to get the experiences for everybody right right and that's another thing is that that you're also attentive to what are the federal regulations on something or, or the state regulations? And, yeah. And, and, and those are there for a reason. <laughs> you know? Exactly. Uh, That's right. You know, and so it's, <laughs> That's it's, right. It's not a conspiracy against you. It's just that. It, it, exactly. It has certain requirements. <laughs> yeah. And it's actually good. Yeah. I mean, exactly. you know, we, we want to have a safe experience mm-hmm. for everybody. Yeah. So. Yeah. Cool. This is the Agentic Schools Vodcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills. What makes education possible is the satisfaction of psychological needs, so that is what these schools have in common with all others. What makes a school agentic is satisfying those needs particularly well. I'm your host. Don Burr.